Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome to my new 10 part series on how to make an exercise more challenging. Today I want to talk about the center of gravity and how this may impact the difficulty of an exercise. So, we take two kettlebells here, our two 15 pound kettlebells. Now our center of gravity is right around our lumbar spine and our runner up right around our sacrum in a standing position. Now, holding the weights here, they are very close to our center of gravity. Now to make this more difficult, we can just change the position of the weights and we can pop them up into a front rack position. Now we have raised the weight up and raise their center of gravity, making this more challenging on the core. If you want to take it one step further, you can pop the weights up overhead and hold them here. Now this is going to put a much greater demand on our core because we've now raised their center of gravity. And as we go upwards with the weight, we've got to resist extension, so it's placing a greater stress onto our core. So our core has got to stabilize when we're in that position, as opposed to pulling them right at our sides, so it's easier. So when you're thinking about Exercise is a good example, maybe a walking lunge. If we hold the weights at our sides here, and we just do forward lunge, it's gonna be easier there as opposed to holding them up and over our head. So, that's one way to think about progressing an exercise or even making it easier, is think about the center of gravity. It's one way we can change the difficulty without increasing the load. So that's just one tip that I wanted to share with you guys. Hopefully this helps.